What's up guys I am back and iOS 11 is finally here but it is still not up to the mark and has a lot of bugs and glitches. So today I'm going to show you how you can downgrade back to iOS 10 without losing data. Now first of all make sure to turn off find my iPhone. This is the key element of the entire process and if you do not turn it off the process will fail and you won't be able to downgrade back to iOS 10. After that you have to turn your phone off. So make sure to connect your lightning cable to your computer where you're going to perform this and you have to connect the cable to your phone. So once your phone is turned off, hold the home button, connect the cable. Do not leave the home button after you connect the cable. Wait for a while until the iTunes screen shows up. So basically you have to put your phone inside recovery mode. From there just hop onto your computer and go to any website that allows you to download the latest version of iOS. In my case I went to ipsw.me. So select your phone, your model and from there you can see right here iOS 10.3.3 is still signed and iOS 11 just dropped. So select iOS 10.3.3 right here, click on it and make sure to download. Once again it is fully signed and it will work with the process. So click on download right here and it should start downloading right away. Now once it's done downloading, keep it anywhere that is safe and more convenient for you to access from iTunes. So once it's done downloading, open up iTunes. You can see right here my phone is in recovery mode and connected. Now make sure to click on update and not on restore. You can also restore the phone if the update does not work but I recommend update if you don't want to lose any data. So shift for windows and option for Mac click that a window will pop up and you can see right here just select the version. Now for some case if Apple stops signing this version or if you're unable to download there's a website called Tenorshare, I'll have the link down below. They have an application called Reboot that comes both for Mac and Windows and they preach that they can help you downgrade back to iOS 10 from iOS 11. So download it, it's free of cost, they don't charge anything. Connect your phone and you can see right here, they have more than 50 plus iPhone solutions. So go inside the second tab and from there make sure to click on enable to update in iTunes and unable to downgrade or upgrade. So from there, once you do so, if you fail on iTunes in any case, for example if you're restoring or if you're updating and Apple say it stopped signing the version, this app will help you to downgrade straight away and will fix all the issues so you'll be able to downgrade. So hope you guys enjoyed that video. More content coming soon. Do give this video a big thumbs up. There are a lot of videos on iOS 11. I'll have the link below. Peace.